Hi everybody, welcome back to Borderlands 2. My name is Mikey Dubs. In today's video, we're rocking some Gage the Necromancer in the randomized roguelands. Gage has been my most successful randomized roguelands characters because Death Trap has been broken. Coming off an amazing win where oh that shield capacity relic is actually brings me right to my point where if you didn't watch the the insanely large shield zero video, go back and watch it because that was an absolute banger. Already, I'm seeing some pretty powerful skills here. We got um, Steady from Action Skill Tree, which gives us a ton of extra grenade damage. On top of that, Money Shot is in this skill tree with Rising Shot from zero, one shot, one kill from zero. I'm seeing this skill tree being with Reaper. Yeah, this skill tree is going to be a lot, a lot of damage. Coming into this skill tree, sharing is carrying, giving Death Shop a copy of my shields. Um, off rip, it really isn't that important unless you're running something like a Roy damage shield for his melee, but. Um, I think Forbearance will be strong here. Critical Ascension is is really good to if you can get the right setup. Overall, I don't see this. I don't see this skill tree going that hard for us. Let's see this one. Like the wind, that's a good skill. That can get us down to more pep. Um, grit, emulate, able. I'm not gonna go feed the meat. Follow through. Okay, so. Look like this, this left side skill tree is going to be the one we absolutely want to use the most. But let's check out to see what gear we get before we make a decision on what skill. Because if we don't get a really strong splash damage weapon, then I'm going to go one shot, one kill. But if we do, like those TDRs, like getting TDRs early game could be what we use to, to pop here. Cooldown rate, max health. Let's go a little bit of cooldown rate. The more we get Death Trap up, the better. So... If we get some TDR action going, which one of these is better? The reload speed is bigger, or is, is much, much faster. Half the reload speed? Yeah, take that. And we have this TDR quick shot as well. So we have got two TDR weapons, which means that we probably want to be going steady. Because our grenade damage can go plus 25%, which is going to be really, really nice for TDR grenade chucks. Okay. Weapon accuracy and reload speed. That's going to be really, really nice for the TDR chucks as well. Let's pitter-patter. Let's get at her. All right, stage one. Hey, tier one, stage one. Get one shot. That's a good sign. Good sign for the future. Ooh, fire. Wait, reload speed slightly slower. Uh, I think I stick with the one I've got. All right, here we go. Chuck, get one shot. Get one shot. See ya. Yeah, everything's getting one shot right now. Really good sign. Oh yeah, see you later. Yeah, we're definitely we're going for the back-to-back -back wins here. Not to spoil the zero run, but let's just say we're going for back-to-back -back wins here. Okay. All right, Death Trap, get out here. This Goliath is getting beat up by a, a spider ant. Um, do we really want to use up all my ammo against this guy? I guess so. No mad plunderer. See you later. The TDR chucks are going crazy. Guy in the back going crazy. See so, ya. Yeah. Easy rounds. Thank you, Death Trap. Yeah, the Death Trap is so, so good. Oh, SMG max ammo. Hogged out of our gourd. Let's go. All right, so five points. One shot, one kill. This actually has some good synergy with... Uh with tdr chucks because the first shot from a fully loaded magazine deals increased damage and we're only firing one bullet so if you think about it right it's one shot chuck one shot chuck we're actually getting a lot of one shot one kill procs so it kind of has that nice synergy now one shot tdr grand chucks and money shot does not have any synergy let's take yeah let's take that Again, assault rifle gun damage can go pretty nuts. If we get the right assault rifle, we're going to want to have an assault rifle relic. My relic main class mod. Okay, let's see here. A rock lance. Street sweeper. A Gatling gun is good. We can go... A Gatling gun would be really, really nice for... The assault rifle relic we... Or assault rifle class mod we just got. I'm not a really... I'm just not a fan of grenadiers in general. Maybe it's more me than it, but I, I kind of disrespect it. 
And decent relics. And what you got for me here? Singularity, a fire burst. We want fire burst. And we like singularities as well. Okay. Let's get it started. Uh, Proso damage, good too. Next. Thank you. Next. The increased SMG max ammo is going to be really, really helpful here. The one more to... Hyperion Jacobs Malawan Tior. Okay. Go ahead. So one shot, one kill. And then pow. Super sick. One shot, one kill. Pow. One more time. One shot, one kill. Pow. See, it, it is good. It is good. I mean, you don't necessarily need the one shot, one kill to make it better, but... Oh my gosh, we actually are one-shotting everything. This is craziness. Ooh, now if I miss. Oh, now if I miss again. See ya. One shot, one kill, pow. <laughs> no death trap needed this round. Hop here. Get me there, get me there. Yes, we're there. Um, This TDR has a larger magazine size, but... Oh, a shock one, that's good. Hey. Getting a shock one is super nice because if we come across an enemy like Cromerax or something like that, we're going to be happy to have that shock. That shock option. Yeah, it looks like this. Because I don't have anything explosive damage related. I have steady, which is not explosive damage. It's grenade damage. So it's going to scale with both. Um, I think we'd be a fool not to take money shot. Reaper would also synergize with one shot, one kill. Yeah, when you throw when you throw a shock TDR weapon, it it does shock damage when it when it hits. So it doesn't do explosive damage. So if we run to Cromer actually Pyro Pete, be a good weapon to have. That being said, now that I have money shot, I I I can both do TDR chucks and use other kinds of weapons like the Gatling gun. Let's see, shield capacity and recharge rates. Last run, that would have gone insanely good. I mean, last run we got, we did get an 8 million size shield. And it got the job done, which is craziness. Craziness. And if you guys want to see my runs days in advance, because I'm grinding out three videos a day right now, but if I end up doing more than three runs in a session, then... It's going to, yeah, sorry for the spoilers. If I'm going to be doing more than three runs in a session, then it's going to be going up days in advance. And I've been putting up my videos days in advance. So if you guys want access to those early videos and then get those, get early comments that I'll be responding to and having discussion about the builds and stuff like that, uh, consider becoming a member on the channel. You guys get early videos, you get member shout outs, and you guys get priority when, re um, when responding to comments. I don't have infinite time to respond to comments. I try to respond to everybody. But if, if I can't respond to everybody, those members definitely, they get highlighted to me first. So, definitely consider it. All right, let's go for this. Oh my gosh. I'm really sorry, bro. That looked, that looked a little bit painful. Let's try, I had never tried, with one shot, one kill, maybe, uh, I just want to use this TDO just for a second. See so, ya. Yeah. Oh my gosh, it's so, it's so brutal, bro. Oh my gosh. Okay. I pop this. Let's see. A bank stick. I wish it was more like a... I don't know, maybe something like a... a Ravager. But regardless, I think it's still okay. It's gonna be a little bit better than my launcher. I've got two launchers on right now. Mm, my Torx probably better, but I kind of like Vladoff launchers. I think they're a little underrated. Dude, you okay? What are you looking at? Yeah. When this bad boy. Good. But for TDR shotguns, you really want one that consumes only one ammo per shot. I'm just not a big fan of TDR shotgun chucks in general. So yeah. I, sh I shouldn't need any more than that on that guy. See you later. Yeah, these shotgun trucks are going absolutely nuclear right now. Whoa! Or TDR trucks, I mean. 
That guy just peeked his head out. He went like, he crawled up here and went, hey. <laughs> if only he, if only he could parkour like me. Let's see, second wind health or corrosive damage. Take the corrosive damage one. And let's go. I think I do want more points into this go tree. Rising shot, reaper, and unstoppable force are really nice. The other skill trees just don't seem like they, they can stack up to this one. Not that we're working towards a capstone or anything like that. Okay. I'm wondering when it'll be a good time to swatch over, swap over to my, my Gatlin gun. For right now, I think the TDR chucks are doing it just fine. Slide. Lob slag bouncing Betty is a really nice is a really nice grenade for tossing down and then having everything around you get slagged. All right, let's go. Boom boom. Me against you. Shoot some bottles. Crack a bottle. Watch your body waddle. Hey, you guys chill down there. I might take a couple of chucks. Yeah. Three chucks for that guy. See ya. I see you. See ya. Where are you? Right there? Oh my gosh. Getting so lucky. Thank you. A oh, grenade. Hey, whoa, chill out, you two. You made, me, you made me blow myself up. Not cool. See you later. All right, let's see what we get here. Fuel capacity, second one health. No, my SMG max ammo one is definitely the way I want to go. Definitely going to be best in slot for now. Face time. No thanks. Keep it moving and just moving. If I can get a corrosive TDR. Ooh, is this one better than my, my option one? It's not. Okay. Keep it moving then. Good stuff. I don't know how good the shock damage is going to be against Boom Boom. I could go that Hyperion Sniper. Let's just try this out. That's not bad damage. We stick with it. Later, homie. What you drop me? An evil smasher. Yuck. Right, here comes the big lad thinking he's all tough. Later. That trap tanked somebody up for me. Not bad damage against the birth. Come on, birth. What up? Here we go. I only have a little bit of ammo left, but that should be just enough to get the job done. Not quite. It's alright. We got we got other options too. <laughs> That's why we diversify our weapons. Very sick. All right, five more points. Hmm. I think this rifle gun damage is gonna be good. Let's go Reaper. Unstoppable Forest is good, too. I'm trying to think about what I want to go into next. I don't have any reload speed or mag size bonuses besides fast hands, but I need to... Wait, no. That's... It's, I, I thought this was the Krieg one, but it's the... It's the Zero one, which increases our reload speed. Okay. I mean, it's all the way at the bottom, though. We have Two Fang... I think we're going to be relying on TDR Chucks for a little bit here. The problem with TDR Chucks is that they don't do as well against raid bosses as they do against other types of enemies. I feel that. I could be wrong about that, but... Long slob slide transformation, we do need that. The adaptive shield. I prefer mine. This is a 1.82 recharge delay. I think that's going to be the way to go. Okay. Let's climb up and get that red chest up there. I almost never climbed for it, and I should try to get get it more. Okay. There we go. This is... Honestly, that's a pretty fun climb. I should do this more often. Don't fall. Oh, I thought that was a TDR. I was going to say, hey, we got a corrosive TDR to, to reward us, but no. We did not. All right. Let's go, turkey. Turkey lurkey. 
I think maybe traditional explosive might be better than shock explosive, but I'm not sure. Let's go get him. Get him death trap. Let's toss a grenade down. Hopefully slag up. Here we go. And then we go for our chucks. Fortunately, I am currently slagged. Let's go for our other TDR. It's not doing that much damage. I need to toss some more of these bad Larrys out here. Can you stop going for me, homie? Go for anybody else. And I can't hit him. He's too quick. Too quick to hit him. Go down. Wow, they don't take any damage. Okay, now you're dead. Thank you. Okay, now we got some decent decent chucks going. Decent chucks, decent chucks. One more chuck and then swap. There we go. I'm surprised how much this this turkey is tanking. My chucks. I have that torque TV to my to my right. I can kill. There we go. Not a bad round. Not a bad round. What you got for me? A lady fist? Do not mind if I do. Teapot. Um. 10% fight for my life duration? Hmm. I don't think so. Alright, this might be the time to swap over to... With our Lady Fist, this might be the time to swap over to Money Shot. Style builds, but the thing is... I'm moving, get increased gun damage, melee damage. Hmm. I just don't have a really good splash damage weapon. Let's go Unstoppable Force. Most of these raid bosses have somebody I can kill, except for Hyperius. So. Should be fine with what we got for now. Let's go for... None of that trash. The, the box is going to be really important for us here, I think. Oh, a Fire TDR. Okay. Box is going to be really important for us. Let's hit the box a couple times to see if we can get something dish. And make our SU decisions based on that. Okay, we get a, we get a B shield. B shield is really nice. Something that synergizes. Okay, a shred of fire. You know what? I need the SDU it. I think it's gonna be. I think it's gonna be pistol, assault rifle, pistol, assault rifle, Grenache. And our weapons of choice are going to be Shredifier, Lady Fist, and anything else. Yeah, let's go. Let's just keep this TDR Chuck thing going well. This Bladed Emperor seems good, but let's just keep this TDR Chuck thing going. And cooldown rate? We don't need cooldown rate quite yet. Let's go. What are we gonna get? What are we gonna get? What are we gonna get? Okay, we do get Hyperius, which is the one fight I didn't really want, but it's the fight that we got. So let's go. Let's do. One shot, one kill. Rising shot. Money shot. Steady. Reaper. That should be good damage. Then, middle skill tree. I just snooze for now. Let's go like wind. All right, see if I can land some crits here. Come on, give me a crit. Give me a crit. There we go. Very good crit damage there. And now... For our class mod, we go with sorry for gun damage. 46. Let's go for this one. Death Trap, you just gotta tank up for me for a little bit here. Good. 
The beast shield popping off. Okay, where's this other guy at? Dang it, my beast shield got popped. Still really strong damage here. Even without the crits. Oh, yeah, that beast shield. Holy moly. Oh, we got hit pretty bad right there. Chill out. Chill out, homie. Transfusions, make it back to me if you could. If you would be so kind. Good. Oh, you you really destroyed my, my beast shield right at the right time, didn't you? Okay. That trap is going down. This is quite bad news. The beast shield is doing very good work here for me. Good. Looks like he's he's vulnerable right now though. Got some of these. Let's go for him. Oh gosh, I might go down. Yeah, I'm going down. I live. I live, I live, I live. Oh my gosh, that's a quick Hyperius. That's a quick Hyperius kill. Oh, what's it? What, can I get that? What is that? Wrong Thunder? Okay. <laughs> More Seraph Crystals. Very good Hyperius kill right there. Lead Storm, not my favorite. It is Slag, though. Ooh. Very, very sick. Okay, what's our reward gonna be? A Retcher or a Longbow Corrosive Crossfire? I don't want either of those, homie. So now we go Unstoppable Force. Oh, I can't. I always forget that I don't get points after the raid boss fight. Should've picked up the Iridium. Spyco is asking, uh, Lady Fist B combo? Question mark. Yes, Lady Fist B combo would be really good there. Um, but hitting the crits on him is, is pretty difficult. Just when he's jumping around, I'd rather just get the guaranteed damage off with the, the Shred of Fire there. However, the, the Lady Fist was definitely going to be my second option. For sure. I mean, it's what we used in the beginning there. But it really does need to hit the crits and it needs to have the B, whereas the Shred of Fire is just... was doing its damage from, from the very first second, so... Let's go. Now, the, one thing that's nice about the Lead Storm is that it gets bonuses from my... From Steady, the accent skill that increases grenade damage. I believe. That's something I might I might Google here. But the problem with the lead storm is that its spray pattern is really hard to use. Yeah, those definitely get splash damage bonuses. So pretty good so far. If we can lead storm B shield these lads with the slag damage coming out too. This could be really, really strong. All right, let's go. Did that trap get out here for me. I'm just not sure how much I can I can keep my. I'm not sure how much I can keep my B shield active here. Oh my, that's so much damage. Holy moly, damage. Aim a little bit high. That's right. I need to aim, aim a little bit higher with this gun. Don't hit me. Don't hit me. Don't hit me. Don't. Oh, he hit me. That's storm though. Looking pretty nice. I do have a way to increase this projectile speed as well. Make it rain. Make it rain. Make it rain. Whoa, whoa. I'm in trouble. I'm actually in a lot of trouble. Got some transfusions out. I'm a little bit high, and I don't quite get it. I'm back, though. Oh, we're so back. Just went this way. Okay, I might have been sleeping on the lead storm a little bit. I think I'm gonna give it some more chances in the future. Let's see, a horror show and a, a slag droog. Okay. We do like the, we do like droogs in this. This this is a droog respecting channel. Oh, that was a one shot. Reload. I'm not making that much use of money shot, but the B shield. This lead storm here is doing a ton for us. Oh, don't get hit. Ooh, nice try, guy. Let's go out here. He damaged me, but it looks like the lead storm is actually pumping with and without the B shield. Very good round. Let's go. Very strong. 
All right, five points. I think this left side skill tree is pretty much capped. I'm the Juggernaut is good, though. The damage reduction is nice. But maybe... Hmm. These are good skills in this tree. Do I have any fire rate bonuses? I don't I feel like I don't have any fire rate bonuses. I would like some. I also want to get down the two fang. I want to get down the velocity and two fang, but it's all the way at the bottom of the skill tree. But I'll get I'll get to the bottom of the skill tree a little bit faster than usual, I think. With critical ascension giving me um an entire skip, just one point. So Keep it moving. Pressure pad me. What did we get? Uh, Aqua means Aquamarine Snyder is good. Another TDR. A fire TDR. Okay. If we have to go TDR trucks, we can't go TDR trucks. But this lead storm is seeming to be kind of a. It's not. I mean, I wouldn't. I call it a, a, a diamond in the rough. But I think it's a known good weapon. But for me, it's a diamond in the rough because I. I usually always snooze on it. The fact that it's slag is pretty good too, because I don't have that much access to slag right now. No interspersed outburst, no scorn, no nothing like that. Legendary Mecromancer. Uh, oh, fire rate and mag size. Minus mag size. That's going to help us with getting more money shots, but I honestly think that the assault rifle gun damage from these class mods is going to be better. Let's go ahead and drop some of these other ones so I don't get confused. Oh, I dropped the wrong one. But if we're using something that's not... If we're using something that's not a assault rifle, then we definitely want the fire rate in the minus max size because we're rocking money shots, got great synergy. But for now, like our best weapons are assault rifles. I could go Lady Fist. I do have a lady fist I can I can use. Um But I I just let that all that storm did a really, really good job for me. This is a tough stage. We gotta get Death Trap out here ASAP. I don't want the Shredder Fire, I want the Lead Storm. There we go. Go down. There we go. Aim a little bit high. Little high, little low, little A, little low, little ho, little ho. <laughs> Let's destroy these laddies up here. Whoa, don't hit me. Nice. Later. Later. Good stuff. These guys zapping me from a distance. Sergeant Blood, are you having a hard time dealing with Death Trap? Most people do. See you later. Ooh, fire rate and ammo regen. Good. Ooh, what a whiff. I guess not. Let's keep it moving. Come on. We gotta get these mega badass dudes to spawn in over here. Oh, wait, I got this power up active. Here we go. Oh, I lost my power up right as they spawn. Not good. That's a really, really bad thing that just happened to us. Gotta run for my life now. Yep. Run for my life. Get the transfusions going. Aim at the sky. Aim at the sky. I think getting Death Trap back is probably more important than anything else. Let's get this double cooldown rate going. That should really help Death Trap get back faster. Run for my life, run for my life. Oh, they all have angles on me. Doing Running away is a, can be troublesome because you have to get kills to get back up, but... Aim a little bit higher, I think. I, I'm just going to go Shred of Fire for a second. Good. A little bit more consistent. Don't go for me. Ah, oh, whoa, whoa. I'm gonna take this guy down. One let storm at a time. Not good. I think I got that reload off though. We, sh we should be fine here, maybe. Come on, rocket launcher. Get me there, get me there, get me there, get me there, get me there. Oh, we are so back. All right, let's just stop messing around. Let's, let's let storm it. Uh, sorry, not Light Storm. Uh, try to fire. The Light Storm is just really hard to use against those small enemies. 
Realistically, it's an easy way to get killed. All right, Shock Storm, I guess. And one point Critical Ascension will get us further down the tree. Okay. I think maybe Lady Piss will do better. But it's tough to know. Ooh, that looks nice. For this zone, I think this is better. There we go. Let's go assault rifle. Let's go back to our assault rifle stuff. Hmm. I don't really have anything good for my assault rifle as a as a as a relic, but for class mods we do. If I can just keep my B shield up. Uh, keep up the momentum with the B shield. The shred of fire should go absolutely off. There you go. You go down. Yeah, see, we're fine as long as we keep the B-Shield up. And the Let Storm makes it a little bit harder to keep up the B-Shield, I think. Okay, you, you want to get high ground? All you're going to do is Skyline yourself. Sometimes high ground is worse. That's, a, that's an instance where it's worse. Badass Goliath, he's going to pop my B-Shield. Got to not die here. There we go. Outplayed. Unstoppable Force will also keep our B-Shield active. Yo. We're very reliant on B-Shield right now, but as Gage player, it's actually not a bad place to be because Death Trap... Death Trap will tank up so much aggro for you. And we go double cooldown when Death Trap goes down. There we go. Not bad. Let's keep going down this middle tree. Critical Ascension, it's, it's just to get us down the tree faster. Um, the, the thing that sucks about this skill tree is all the best skills are at the bottom. Two Fang and Velocity are the ones I want. Like those are the big ones that I really, really want. Okay, open this bad boy up. See, fire rate minus magazine size. Okay. Is this one better than my current assault rifle gun damage one? I think it is. Yeah, I, th I think I want the extra damage over the. Anything else in there? There's the borderland symbol. Something good for me. Oh, there we go. There's, a, there's mouthwash. That's going to help my assault rifles out quite a bit. Now we can actually be pumping some serious deeps. Is that another Trug? Ah, Pushka. Okay. Let's go. Haters folly. This guy can deflect bullets back at me, but we should be fine. We have the assault rifle class mod and assault rifle relic. Toss this. Nice block, nice block, brother. Don't be blocking. Don't you be blocking. There we go, big sleep. Not a big deal. Oh, where'd my beast shield go? Do I not have unstoppable force to give me back my shields? I didn't take points in it. That's a huge mistake. Huge mistake. I need that skill. That's what's gonna keep my beast shield up way more consistently. After each kill, getting back my shields. He lost my B shield. It's okay though. We we'll stick on him. My shot's not really doing very much for us with the assault rifles that we have, but I'd much rather be doing this than using anything else. To be honest with you. There we go. Gotta reload off. Don't dam. Don't take any damage, and you can't die. The bulls that. Sick. And we are... Oh, Rough Rider. Hmm. What's my current shield? Oh, it's the B. That's right. I think the B is just better. Alright, so we definitely want... We definitely want Unstoppable Force. I got a feeling we're gonna get... I, I just have a gut feeling that we're gonna get... Um, Captain Flint next. 
because we have a, a B shield build that's going to be completely countered by deflect. And whenever I have this build, I always get Captain Flint who can deflect my shots. But up here, we're doing quite well. Monstrous Snyder, sure, I guess, but let's do some shovels. Shovel number one is right there. Shovel number two is right there. And let's go get shovel number three. Reload me. Right there. Good stuff. Okay. Pop that. Let's see. Transfusion. I, I already have a better transfusion than that. Well, that's what we are looking for. We are looking for transfusion grenades. I would climb up there, but it's going to... Honestly, the opportunity cost isn't worth it. Let's just keep it moving. A dragon keep. Not, a, not an easy fight whatsoever. But let's use the speed shield to maximum effectiveness. I don't know which one's which. There it is. There's the boss. Swept over to the ladyfish right away here. No, let's just, just get a reload off. Reload. Don't take damage. Don't take damage. Hey, they're, they're all on death trap right now, which is absolutely enormous. Hey, don't damage me. Don't you know I need that? B shield? Not bad. Look at that. Blink on the death trap so I can keep my B shield up. Not bad. The damage is going early. And he's slagged. Oh, my ears, though. Holy ears. Let's turn down the sound box a little bit. Be a little bit more bearable now. So, so you want to spawn in more dudes? That's fine with me. All right, now you go down. I don't have that trap. Let's go ahead and go double cooldown here. Double cooldown. Double cooldown. Getting that trap back is more important than anything else, in my opinion. Going for some free deeps. That trap basically gets me just my B shield up infinitely. I'm gonna start taking damage here now, though. Still no. And once that trap gets back up, we go that trap double swap now. Back over to Assault Rifle Gun Damage. And Assault Rifle Damage. There we go. Now the now the deeps is really ramping. Feels good to beat this guy, because I had a really fun Salvador run that got defeated by him. Hey. Nothing too crazy as far as weapons here. Weapon accuracy and reload speed sounds nice. Okay, pop that. See, a grog nozzle is very good for healing root uh, purposes. Unfortunately, the ruby just gets outclassed by the grog nozzle, so. Stink pot, too. All right, five points. Oh, Kerblaster. blaster. Doesn't fire very fast, though, but it does have extreme synergy with my skills. All right, so. Counter strike into. Quick charge, I think is going to be good. Oh, Psycho tells me that the stink pot works with steady. That's good to know. Unfortunately, the one raid boss that it works against I've already defeated. So, but if I go, in, if I if I get into an area where it's going to be useful, I'll use it. Um, a carnage and a longbow. What is my? I think I definitely just want to increase some of these bad Larrys. Assault rifle, pistol. Launcher. Let's hit. Let's get one more hit at the box. Peak opener. Here it comes. Oh, that's a better. That's better cooldown, right? Than my. Than mine, I think. Yeah, it is. Cool. Forty-five percent. Even better. All right, let's go launcher. Launcher. Good. All right, death trap. Help me out here. 
Pyro Pete, okay. That trap get out here. Toss. He's closing the gap on me. Go ahead, go for Death Trap instead, homie. Go for Death Trap instead. Go for Death Trap instead. He's 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 the one hurting you, not me. He's the one hurting you, not me. Okay, he's gonna use his his Nova. Go ahead, Nova, dude. Go ahead. We know it's coming. Yeah, there it is. I think I got the right angle here. Good stuff. Keep going, B shield. Keep it going. Yes. We need to we need to slag him. Rinse him while we can. Good. This is a really quick pirate repeat kill. So far. Okay, hopefully don't take any damage from those. Yep, go ahead, do your Nova. See if I care. Okay. I could probably go Lady Fist here. Okay, let's just go ahead and get some get some cover. Okay. I really just want Death Trap to be back up, honestly. It's gonna hide until he does his Nova again. I'm gonna start going for distance. Come on, go for your Nova, homie. There it is. So after this Nova, I'm gonna go ahead and get distance. Get, de get Death Trap out here. Toss this nade. And then we go for the... The damage again. Didn't get slag on that nade. That's crazy. Come on now. And you just slag up for me. There we go. That's damage right there. Ah, uh, he hit me. Okay, I can also try Lady Fists. I'm not gonna make it. I'm not gonna make it. I'm not gonna make it. Ah, shoot. Okay, not. It's impossible for me to get my. For me to get my um, B shield back up while I'm taking this dot, so let's go ahead and cleanse it. Ow, that hurt. Okay, not bad. That was easy. Uh, yeah, maybe Lady Fist plus B combo is a little bit stronger than the assault rifles. At least for that fight. That was really, really, really quick. Slack crossfire. Could use that. Okay, we're gonna use this to see if uh, this the screen candy. Ooh, Seraphim. That's a nice assault rifle. All right, we're gonna use this green candy to see if we can uh, get through this whatever next stage is faster. Don't really want a cradle. Okay, I'm glad I saw that hornet. I don't have to go assault rifles. We saw what the lady fist just did to that guy. Okay, three, two, one. Decent run going right now. Actually, this is the one. This is this is the exact stage that I took this green power up for. My min maxing is insane. All right, blast these. Get me over there. There we go. Perfect. And time's out right when I get to 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 the. Uh, to the butt stallion. Nice. Moving on. Alright, tier three, ready for the give me a gub. Go. I like the double gub. Thank you. The marksman's gub. Okay. Let's see. I'm gonna have to be really picky with my weapons now. This lady fist, it's a little bit tough. I mean, honestly that. That recharge rate one might be a little bit better if I don't get something that benefits the Lady Fist. Yeah. Like, just having show capacity and recharge rate. The capacity's not so good. I don't really want a higher capacity. I just, I'd rather get recharge delay. What do we get? 
the fridge. This, again, I get a bunch of enemies that are impossible to crit. <laughs> um, but let's take... I can see through this death trap a tiny bit. There we go. Fire rate and minus magazine size. Okay, come on now. That trap. Are you going to help me out? Dude, go fight them. Please. I need, I need to keep my B shield up. I need, I need a crit. Here we go. One crit takes it takes this thing to the moon. Death trap is just not fighting. There we go. Finally, homie. There we go. Good crits. Got my B shield back. These enemies are really tough to crit, but honestly, we're, we're pulling it off. Thanks, Death Trap. Appreciate you. Okay, good. Psycho says that I think the ladyfish shoots too slow, but it could still work. Yeah, uh, luckily we do get this fire. We have a fire rate class mod that we can use to pump up its fire rate a little bit more. That, even more. <laughs> But we're doing okay. Grab this power up, might as well. Okay, who's over here? See you later. Not quite. Dang, my B shield got popped. Okay, it starts recharging right away, which is nice. Okay. Oh, that's right. I got the power up. Holy cow. I forgot about that. All right, magic missile or tidal. Oh, my favorite gun. Give me that tidal wave. Completely not a good weapon for this build. And then the magic missile was right there. I could have taken it, but... Is it the tidal wave? Come on now. I also have a grog nozzle that I don't have equipped. This thing is sick. Just sick. Love it. Okay, so... Let's do quick charge. And two fang. I don't. I really don't think this is a good a good run for the for this weapon, but it could just. It's just so much fun. Let's see. I really do not want that anarchist class mod. I I need the accuracy as much as I can. Okay. That's pretty good accuracy right there. I can get like a, a sheriff's badge to 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 pair with my to pair with this pistol. I think it could be really really good. Bearcat, thunderball fist, striker, retainer. No, I mean the carnage is there. Oh, unicorn explosion is here too. Okay, those work with steady. No thanks. Uh, top down, I think, uh, I think I missed, did I, did I pick up, I don't think I got this, this borderland symbol back here. So let's check it out. Mm, no, thanks. I was hoping to get maybe a sheriff's badge. All right, what do we get? Our robots. Okay, this could be a good run for the tidal wave. Let's just do it. Let's have some fun with the tidal wave. Blast him. Oh, come on. Do some more damage than that, homie. Mm, it's not going to do more damage than that. That's fine. We'll get him next time. Use it next time. With the right build, with the, with the right setup, it, it does go pretty hard. Pretty, pretty pog crazy. What is that? Legendary Catalyst? No, thanks. Quick Charge plus, um, plus Unstoppable Force. The two skills that I have for regening my shield are really, really insanely good for... For the B shield. Especially in mobbing rounds. Because I can just run around this mobbing round and just every time I get a kill, my shield just comes right back. You'll see it right here. So get this kill. Then my shield just regens really quickly back up to full. And I can try to get more B shield procs. Like against this guy. Left, right, and then back to the center. Oh, someone's behind me, a junk loader. Someone's one-shotting me. That's not good. Left, right. Some center action. 
Come on. Oh my gosh. I can't believe I didn't get that kill. Come on. Don't take damage. Don't take damage. There we go. Be shield back up and running. Strong. Destroy that, laddie. Good. Not a bad round. If I actually the turn, Morbus or a hive? We take a hive. Two fang. Velocity. I want I want faster bolts. And sorry the tidal wave. It's just not gonna I'm not it's right now it's not that useful. Mm, the shield capacity and recharge rate, I'd rather just I'd rather not, honestly. I'd rather just have the cooldown rates. Okay, hop over here. There's one red chest over here, and I think we're gonna look for the borderland symbol as well. If there should be one. I don't think is this the Arid Nexus Badlands? If it is, then it might not be a, a, a borderland symbol. But there's a pressure plate. I want to get that too. It's underneath here. Okay. Pitchfork, very good with a B shield. Peak opener. Do not mind if I do. Two peak openers. Check the stats. Check the stats. Okay, that one's much better. I'm much rather have the reload speed. Hive plus grog nozzle would be funny. True. Okay. Well, we got ourselves a peak opener. So, and that goes pretty hard. With all the skills that we have. All right, so. Let's get assault rifle back in here. Assault rifle, gun damage, magazine size, and mouthwash. Bada bing, bada boom. All right, let's just go next. The rust yard's very nice. Okay, we got a perfect build for this setup. That trap, get out here. Deep sea whaler. Ow, that hurt. That hurt a lot. What I could do is, let's go ahead and get our Grog Nozzle out here. Mr. Nozzle, mm -mm -mm. bring me a dream. Ba -da -da -da. That's the elegant ruby. Doo -doo -doo -doo. Where's my Grog? How far down do I got to go to find it? There we go. And then a Lady Fist as well. So we got a Grog Nozzle for healing up. Anchorman are just tough to deal with in general. Where did I put my peak opener? There it is. There we go. Gone. Yes, sir. Alright, what is that? Oh, it's legendary. It's a, it's a grenade. That's. I think a fire leech could go hard. Let's use it. B shield plus peak opener. Good. And I've got grenade damage with steady. Yep. Let's go. go Tunguska for second wins yeah maybe I could have done Tunguska for second wins do I have a Tunguska Did I pick it up no nah, I'm maybe it's because the Tunguska has put me down and killed me more often than not but at this point the peak opener probably does more damage than a Tunguska for second winding okay 13 out of 15 I want to use this for next round because next round could be a a decent boss killer Demonic Angel asks, hey, I've watched a lot of your randomizers and notice you don't use death mark when you get it. Is there a reason? I take it just in case, but usually, like, if you go up in the melee range of enemies, it you can get yourself killed pretty quickly. So I take it, I probably shouldn't. Um but never really use it. But yeah, you're right. I probably could be using it more often than I do. Alright, more pep here. Not bad. Okay, let's grab this power up and let's go straight to the next stage, or should I grab... I know where the pressure plate is here. So let's let's head back there. I think I took a wrong turn. Yeah, took a wrong turn. I'm gonna grab that pressure plate. And I, actually, I don't know what the Borderlands symbol is, but I know what the pressure plate is. I think.
Okay, yeah, it's back here. Give me, give me. Give me, give me, give me some launchers that I can use. Okay, Tunguska. Okay. Never punished. Or a Nukem. No, Tunguska or Nukem for a second wins. The Nukem, it's more likely to not kill me when I'm getting a second win, so. I think the Nukem probably out is probably better. I also want to look for um, a Sheriff's Badge, potentially. Because if I can get a Sheriff's Badge, that can really ramp up my crit damage. Incendiary damage, or no. Okay. Let's go next. I should have picked up that power-up, but we're fine. Is it Oni? No, it's not Oni. Thank God. All right, look, watch these lads. See you later. <laughs> Velocity plus peak opener is ridiculous. Okay. Okay. Well, that did not work out the way I wanted it to. Okay, let me back up. That's a leech. Oh, there was no enemies to hit. Your speed run this stage, though. Leave some grenades there for him. A little welcoming presence for when they jump down. Okay, now it's just the boss. Leech him. Come on, spawn in. Shouldn't be too hard of a fight here. Don't want to accidentally uh, blow up that... Blow up this again. Oh, he resists shock, this guy. That's right. Forgot. That's okay. Even if he resists shock, he goes straight down. What you got me? Cowboy. Listen here, cowboy. Okay. Don't need any of those. We're gonna go... Grit. So this, these skills are really good for dragon fighting. Whereas, I can probably drop some of this, some of these kill skills. So before the dragons, we definitely will be going for a respec. Dropping some kill skills, potentially. Alright, shouldn't be too hard of a fight here. Bring it on. Don't need slag, doesn't look like. Yep, just going to immediately get her into her, her defense form. Can I please get a little bit faster here? Slightly faster, thank you. Badass spiders. See you later. Okay. Death Trap tanking up a lot of these spiders for me, which I really appreciate. Bust out a leech. There we go. She should be jumping down soon. Yep. Good, good timing on that. Oh, I lost my B shield. Shoot. And you get one kill you and then go for the go for the big lad dang it i keep taking damage she's gonna she's gonna do her heal juice on me anytime now yep she has it up stop damaging me shoot here we go get your shield back up homie get your shield back up don't take damage from that yes okay b shield activate Oh, you're going to try to heal juice on me? Nope. Go into your defense form. Okay. It's the last fight before the dragons. Okay. Go down. Come on now. Death Trap has got such a long cooldown. It's really tough. I'll stop a force though. The, the actual movement speed I'm getting from it is just ridiculous for this fight. I'm just mitigating so much damage just by not taking it at all. Ah, man. Got tagged. Badass spider was the one who did it. Okay. Our shields are coming back now. Jump across here. Don't take much damage. And then we got our B shield back up. This should be the end of the run. Yes. Good. Whew. Class mods, class mods, class mods is what we're looking for now. Blast this lad. Gonna rang, don't don't ever show your face here again. Chain lightning me? Oh imagine. The Becca goes crazy hard. Cause it can crit. Yeah, the Becca can crit, which means it goes crazy hard, but the thing is Becca plus velocity is kinda meh. 
Um, but I think with this B shield, I think we might have something here. All right, come on. We are heading into the dragon fight. This should be... I mean, with... Oh, pistol damage. Okay, now... I think the Lady Fist might be the best possible option now. More than the peak opener, even. Okay. Alright, let's see what we can get from this. I do want to grab pistol max ammo if it's not capped. Okay, we're good there. Um, A B shield with a faster recharge delay would be good. Okay, let's see. And a, and a higher cooldown rate on Death Trap would be good too. We're just, again, we're just hitting the box just because. Alright, so. A respect is in order. Let's go ahead and grab. Forbearance an absolute must. I think I... Do I really want to use... I think I do want to use two fangs. So let's, let's go ahead and do it. Critical ascension. We're just trying to get down to the bottom of this tree is all. Um, Lear health, the greater the bonus. I think what we really want to do is cook it up trouble, maybe? No, oh, just got real might be better. But the thing is, honestly, quick charge? Quick charge will be useful. Um, It will be useful, because once we kill, kill one dragon, getting our shield back would be nice. All right, let's go like the winds. More pep for one, I guess. Ritz. Able. Let's go with Immolate. And Fast Hands. Good. Now we go... I would say one shot, one... Maybe Steady. Rising Shot. We're going to want to go all the points in my shot that we can possibly get, so... We're going to have to do a respec here. We can't take everything. We're going to have to make decisions. Yo, money shot. Reaper is just so strong. Do I really care about these skills down here? I think I do. That's the problem. I think I do care about them. I do want grit and able as well. And immolate. Forbearance as well. Um... Let's see. The, this skill doesn't really matter. Let's get down further. Let's do quick charge. And two fang. And accelerate. That's for the critical to hit damage more than anything else. And fast hands. We're going to ditch. We're not going to have Reaper. But that's okay. So I think our main weapon of attack here is going to be our Lady Fist. It's going to help us bring them down. And then we're going to go to cooldown rate uh, when the time comes. Let's go for fire rate in minus magazine size for those big money shot crits. I believe in us. The Lady Fist might get us there. I mean, I'm really hoping that it gets us there. All right, we're going to take down green first so we can get lads. We definitely want to be getting those lads. A uh, death trap, get out here. Hit green, get, get green down here. Wait, I don't take any, any damage here. Don't go for me, go for somebody else. Where's that face? There we go. Yeah, that's a one shot. Where's that face? Where's his face at? There we go. Now blue, get down here. I took damage, I took damage. But that's why we took quick charge, right? Why we took quick charge. Forbearance plus quick charge should get us our B back relatively quickly. Where's my B shield? Come on. Give me my B shield back. Yes. That's that's gonna hurt. That's gonna hurt. Okay, yeah, that's gonna hurt. Let's start grog nozzling while we're here. Yeah, we definitely need to start grog nozzling. Need to start grog nozzling. Ooh, okay. Good heal. Good heal. Death trap, I need you to start tanking up the boss, my man. 
Okay, Death Trap is down. I need Death Trap as back as soon as possible. So we're going to go for this 45% cooldown. And 43% cooldown. And just try to live. That's all. All we're trying to do now is live. Go. Get healing it down here. Come on, get down here, homie. No one else has landed yet. There we go. Ah, shoot. Okay, come on. Uh, not good. Don't go down. Don't go down. I need to. I need to save these. I need to save these lads as much as I can. All right, death trap. Get back out here. And we go back to our weapon accuracy and the reloads. Not the not the reload speed. The fire rate and the minus max size and pistol gun damage. We saw what we saw what we can do if we get. Oh come on, man! Stop damaging me. Hit death trap. Ah, uh, they they just refuse to hit that trap right now. Come on, hit that trap. Hit that trap. Hit that trap. There we go. What is what is going on with my my inventory right now? Give me my lady fist back. There we go. No, that. I swear I'm bugged. I swear this game gets the inventory gets so bugged. There it is. Okay, we are, we, are we good to go now? There we go, Death Trap. Tank up for me. Land that crit. Land that crit. There we go. That light goes down. Where's, where's Purple? Purple, where are you? Oh, Purple's over here. Hit him. Oh, he's, this guy's gonna hit me. He's gonna damage me. He is pet. He's mad at me. Oh, that crit. That, oh my gosh, get one shot. Let's go. The one shots are crazy. Oh no, I'm, I'm taking burn. Shoot. Okay, I don't have my B shield. It's honestly, let's 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 play this smart. Play the long game. Cool down. And cool down at 43. Swap to my grog. And we just try to survive. Let's try to survive this. Oh, if, looks like the transfusion doesn't doesn't. Um, if I'm fighting against a fire damage enemy, I was watching closely and it didn't it didn't come back for me. So there we go. Oh, I just used my grenades for n literally no reason, but should have waited until I was a little bit lower on HP. Keep the grog out. Keep the grog out. There we go. So we can get that trap out here and roll and, and taking damage from me. I'm going to wait, actually, until he takes off. He's going to take off soon. And when I get him back on the ground, that is when I will use Death Trap for maximum effectiveness. There we go. Go ahead. Do your thing. Okay, so now we Death Trap out. That's a waste of a Death Trap, actually. I should have waited for him to go into def out of defense form. That's okay. What we can do is... Go fire rate, minus mag size. Pistol gun damage. There we go. Now, get out of defense form and you're getting one shot, kiddo. Come on, get out of defense form. Oh, I missed my, I missed my minor shot. Oh, yeah. Yes! The back-to-back. -back. Let's go. Yes. Woo! Gage makes it happen. The bee shield, the lady fist, absolutely terrorizes it. Completely terrorizes it. Yeah, Gage just makes it so, so simple. You you tank and I spank, brother. Very, very nice. A very clean one. Woo! Very, very good. That lady fist was... That's probably the fastest I've ever uh, killed each one of the individual dragons the, the lady fist plus money shot yeah super super powerful anyways thank you all very much for watching if you enjoyed hit the like button subscribe to see more videos like this one remember if you guys want to see videos early hit that member join button and i'll see you all in the next one bye